guys, welcome back to another video. Today's video, I am doing a review. And before I, before I get into that review, I'm gonna be a little bit awkward for this video because, well, if you didn't know, my, my room is at the top of the house. So I've got the roof, basically, above me. Which, and right now, there are people fixing our roof. <laughs> They're right there. And it's really scary because I'm like talking to this camera that they <laughs> But anyway, they can't see they can't see that talking to a camera, but I'm gonna do this for you guys. Just because I haven't filmed a video in a very long time. But today, today I am doing a review of the call by let's try and not butch the sitting. Pade or Glee. I've completely messed that up. It did come with a phonetic when I got sent this, but I can't find it anywhere. But if I find it, I will I will literally link the phonetic down below so that you can, I will, I will type it down below so you guys can actually know how to say it. But basically, yes, this is sent to me by David Ficken Books in exchange for a review, which is what I'm gonna do for you now. Um, so this book took me a long time to read because I've been in insane, an insane amount of reading slumps. 2016 has not been a good year for me in terms of reading and filming and 2017 it's going to be really great for that. I'm going to do loads of reading, loads of filming, all that kind of thing and there will be a video coming up on that on, on all of this like my 2017 reading plans but basically yeah this took me such a long time to read because I was reading other books with it and I just, I just wasn't reading so much, but I know that every time I read it and I really sat down and involved myself, <laughs> and involved myself in it, it was really amazing and I thoroughly enjoyed the story. I thought that, I think that if I just read it on its own and not read anything else, I'd have read it so quickly because it's so gripping and the story is so different and so interesting. It's basically about um, this, these people in Ireland uh, and when you are in your teen years um, you are in the, you go to the school and you, and you train to try and survive what they call the call and the call in the human realm I'm gonna call it uh, is three minutes and 14 seconds it's about three minutes long but in the seed I'm gonna call it the seed uh, it's like the that's what that's the Irish name for fairies, I think. But in that realm, it's a whole day. And basically, when you when you are called to the realm, you you are you you have to survive, and the seed are trying to kill you. But basically, this whole story gets really twisted and involved. And if you don't like gore, I'd suggest not reading this because they, sometimes people come back from the call and they are completely more than gross and disgusting. But I found it really. I thought that I thought that the way that it was written was so well done because it could have been so samey samey but it wasn't and I really really enjoyed it and I think that the characters were really good as well they were really well developed I think Nessa is a great character she has a disability with her legs meaning that she can't walk or run properly as well as anybody else can but the way that she's still determined to survive is really inspirational and I, and I really enjoyed that part of the book that it wasn't just like just same as all these other books out there right now um, so yeah that was a really really good part of the book and um, there is a little bit of love but the fact that Nessa is so is so bent on surviving means that this love doesn't really filter into the book that much. It does towards the end, which is really, really great, and, re and she really deserves it, but it's not all about that, meaning that you can just focus on the action. And there's so many other characters in this book that I remember. Like, I, I can remember all the characters. I think there's, I think her best friend is, I don't remember, I'm really bad with names, but I can remember exactly what they're like. There's Miss Breen, the head teacher. There's Connor, this really awful guy and um, her best friend, Megan, and Megan is so great, and there's also a bit of LGBT in this, it's, it's just got everything you could possibly imagine, and it just opens up to every type of person, and 
Yeah, it's set in Ireland, which is different. I've never read a book set in Ireland, really. I've never really read a book set in the UK before, which is which is really good, it's really interesting. I thought that it was absolutely incredible, but I just wish that I'd read it on its own and really dedicated my time to it. And I think that's what you guys should do. Like when you read it, you should just just read this one because it takes it takes a bit of investment to get it done. Because you can get it read really quickly. It's a really easy read, and it and it deserves all your attention. I think. I think that if you were to read it with other things like I did, I did remember it really really well. But if I had to do it again, I would read it on its own so I could get it done quicker because it's just that good. So yes, I would highly, highly recommend that you guys go check this one out. It's so good. Kind of similar to, I want to say The Hunger Games, uh, in that kind of atmosphere, but it is absolutely nothing like it in terms of storyline. Um, but it's, I can't compare it much to anything else because it's just so unique and individual and I really think you guys should go and give this book some love because it doesn't, it, I think it, I think it is getting a lot of love on booktube, I haven't really seen it, but I think, I think we should put it out there a little bit more. So highly, yes, highly recommend this one and I think you guys should go check it out. So yes, this is The Call by, I'm not going to try to say his, his name again, but Yes guys, go and check this out. Thank you guys so much for watching. All my social media links will be down below in the description. Go and like and comment saying hi. Tell me if you've read this book or if you're going to read it. If, if you're going to read this book or anything like that, I'd love to hear from you guys. And yes, I will see you guys super, super soon in another video. Bye.